guys so uh i'm just here updating you um i'm on my second peak week um of my competition season um i'm going into la championships this weekend um this saturday it's a muscle contest show it is thursday today it's about 4 p.m on thursday so i'm just about finishing up all my peak week glamour whatever stuff like nails and eyebrows and whatnot anyways um, so this peak week has been a little bit different than the peak week I did for Team U. My body actually has been responding um, a little bit better. I'm actually two pounds below stage weight than what I was for Team U, and I'm eating um, I'm eating more, and I'm doing less cardio, and I'm a thousand times less stressed out because of multiple reasons. Um, my macros this week are on low days. They were 80 carbs. 35 fat and 130 protein. High days were 200 grams of carbs, 35 fat, 130 grams of protein. And for Team U, I was doing 60 carbs for low days, which was a, which was a little lower. And now I'm maintaining my body weight and actually losing weight with a little bit more food in me, which is really great. Um, I'm doing less cardio. So for Team U, I don't think I was ready because I, we had to do a little bit more um, cardio the week before, so I was doing depletion days where I was on 60 or 50 grams of carbs and doing an hour of cardio. I had a half hour of moderate and a half hour of um, high intensity interval cardio, and this week I was only doing the 80 grams of carbs on low days and 30 minutes of um, hit cardio on the low days, so I'm feeling much better i'm less stressed i look better i feel better um i have my amazing coach to thank for that i really wanted to like give him a shout out because it's really rare that you come across people like that that actually care about um other <laughs> other people in general and actually care about their health his health my health his health my health has always been his number one priority this whole entire prep um, not it not even just my physical health but my mental health we never did any water depletion we never did any sodium cutting we never took any diuretics um, even an hour of cardio was only for the last week before that I was only doing a half hour up until like the last two weeks before team U, but now I'm doing a half hour so it wasn't for a long period of time or anything and I didn't really find it too excessive um, some people start off with an hour of cardio a day. Hi Lucy. She's coming to join the video. And she's probably gonna lick me everywhere. I was, I'm getting off topic. Lucy, you're distracting me. Okay. Um, some people start off their prep with really low carbs and really high cardio and then by the end they're just doing they're essentially whittled down to nothing doing so much cardio and eating essentially nothing that their body has nowhere else to go so we had my mental and physical health in mind this whole entire prep which will help me post show not i don't feel any urge to like binge on a bunch of candy like i see people post all the time when they buy like a ton of candy or a ton of cupcakes or a ton of whatever for their post show treats and they have it all in like this like grocery haul of like crap and they're planning on eating it all post show and I'm just like ugh like, I have no desire to do that the only thing that I really want is probably a margarita <laughs> I haven't had a drink since December this past year and it's now July um, that's just by choice but I don't have any crazy cravings or crazy urges to binge I don't feel the need to bring a bunch of like super high calorie treats for competition day or anything like that um the day after i'm just gonna go back to tracking my normal macros we're gonna start my reverse diet which i'm super excited about um i am excited that i have a coach to coach me through my reverse diet as well i'm keeping my coach um i hired him again for my reverse diet and i'll probably keep working with him He's honestly so amazing. Like he has been keeping in, um, he's been checking in with me every single day for the past two weeks to make sure that I was ready for this upcoming show. Um, so highly recommend him. He is amazing. Um, what else? 
I really wanted to do another local show. Um, I was planning on doing USA's in Vegas next weekend, another national show, but after Team Universe, I kind of decided that personally, not that my placement discouraged me or anything, like the placement to me, um, it doesn't it doesn't hold my highest priority and it's not my highest it's not my biggest goal it's not my main goal is to be an IFBB pro like maybe that's in the cards for me maybe it's not I'm gonna do my best regardless and if it happens it happens but um, I'm not willing to put my body through anything crazy to get there um, and I probably would have in order to be competitive against um, people who are already at that level for uh, USA's and I don't think I look bad at all. I don't think I'm not ready. I don't think I couldn't have been competitive. Um, I think I feel I feel great now. I'm really excited for um, this show this weekend. It's a local show, so um, it's just gonna be, it's actually two minutes from my wonderful apartment here, which is really great. So I don't think I couldn't have been competitive, but personally, I would like more time. Um, I'm completely natural. I don't this is all just diet and exercise um again i don't plan or ever want to put my body through anything crazy just to step on a stage um i'll bring my best every um competition prep that i do but again not pushing my body any to, to do anything unhealthy so to get to the point of being um, a competitive level compared to everybody else i just think my body needs more time to um, grow some muscle maturity, um, gain a little bit more muscle in certain areas, and then maybe even have like a longer prep in order to get lean at um, the right time period in order to not have to do anything too drastic. My body does not like being lean. It's been angry at certain points in my prep and it's been fighting me sometimes, but regardless, um, I decided against doing that just to take some stress off of myself and um, doing the show this weekend is a good way for me to um, actually feel like I'm bringing my best. At Team Universe, I don't think I brought my best, and I clearly needed a little bit extra time, um, the extra two weeks to feel that way, um, even with a little bit more food in me, so and a little bit less cardio and a little less tired. I'm a lot less crazy, and I'm a <laughs> I'm not a crazy prep girl right now. I'm just kind of easing into the show, which is wonderful. So there's that. I'm really excited. Um, I'm going to bring a better package this weekend. My stats right now are 5'3". Um, I'm 108, which is super low for me. Um, I haven't been that since I was... It was show day for New England's back in November. So feeling super tiny right now like a little baby animal <laughs> but there's that and um, current macros are 200 like I said 200 grams of carbs on high days every three or four days usually three days of low and then one high day and then repeat the cycle um, and then low days are at 80 grams of carbs right now and I'm excited to be eating more food and start my reverse diet and start building a little bit more muscle for myself and working on some other projects so that's my update for now and I will update you guys again tomorrow when I get my spray tan and after check-ins and everything like that so talk to you then hello okay so it is Friday night it's about 9 p.m. Um, I just got back to my house after getting my spray tan and I checked in at the host hotel um, I'm competitor number 75 tomorrow bikini class B um, bikini open and I'm pretty excited I'm feeling really good um, after check-ins today I'm feeling pretty confident and my coach just told me tomorrow is just going to be another day of looking good, so I'm kind of just easing into the show tomorrow. Um, really excited about it. Feeling good, feeling confident, feeling way better than last time. Um, what else tomorrow we get there? Um, it starts at 10 promptly. Supposedly, muscle contest shows are pretty on point with time or so I've heard. Um, starts at 10. Ooh, I have some diet face going on. Some weird 
can things going on too. Good morning, y'all. So in order to not mess up your orange spray tan that you have, you have to not get it wet, which I already did by peeing on myself yesterday. So anyways, usually that's not a problem in California, but it is raining just a little bit. I just got to the venue. I'm gonna sit here, drink my coffee until it goes away because it is sure to go away and I don't want to mess up my tan. But anyways, um, I'm feeling really good this morning. Uh, everything went as perfectly as it could have, so I'm feeling good, I'm really excited. Um, it's about 8 a.m. right now, show starts at 10. Um, bikini goes on somewhere in the middle, so I'll let you guys know soon. Talk to you soon. Hello. Laying here with my friend Raquel. Oh my god, that camera's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> the best part of competing is making friends. Aww. So she's we such a sweet we are friends. And she's in bikini class A and she's gonna kill it. Um, what else are we doing? I'm in bikini class B and we're hanging out here. We're gonna go on stage in probably an hour. So we're laying down, relaxing, hair, makeup all done. Looks scary. <laughs> and we're just spending our time taking pictures of each other, so. Because that's what's really important in life. Keep posted. Hey guys, uh, overall champ, not expecting that, um, at all, and I know I said in my, uh, earlier video that I wasn't doing USAs, but after winning the overall at a contest, um, muscle contest show, USAs is a muscle contest show, the head judge said I should go. I now feel less um, discouraged about me not being ready for nationals because clearly I, I sort of am. So I'm going to USA's next weekend. Um, I'll do some more vlogs this week. Another peak week coming up. Happy healthy peak week yet again. So thank you guys for all of your love and support like all of the comments on Instagram and everything like that like I'm so overwhelmed I want to comment back to every single one of you and I will eventually um, I totally appreciate every single one of them um, I love you guys you guys make me happy thank you mm.